when you, the contestant, start the game, there are three possible cases. The prize, indicated by the dollar sign, is either behind door C, behind door B, or behind door A. Since you obviously have no idea which of the three cases you're faced with, you choose one of the three doors at random. Say you choose door A. If you're in case 1, where you chose door A and the prize is behind door C, the host will obviously reveal the empty door B to you, in which case, in order to win, you need to switch from door A to door C. If you're in case 2, where you chose door A and the prize is behind door B, the host will obviously reveal the empty door C to you, in which case, in order to win, you need to switch from door A to door C. And finally, if you are in case 3, where you chose door A and the prize is behind door A, the host can reveal either one of the remaining empty doors. Say that the host reveals door B. Note that this is the only case out of the three in which in order to win, you should stay with the door you initially chose. Let's summarize. There are three possible cases in the game. We saw that in two of the three cases, if you switch, you win. And only in one of the three, if you stay, you win. Since you have no idea which of the three cases you are faced with, you might as well go with the switching strategy, because in two out of the possible three cases, it will lead you to winning.